Chris Sims, The Elements of Scrum Dive into the world of agile development with The Elements of Scrum by Chris Sims and Hilary Louise Johnson. This book will take you through the ins and outs of the Scrum methodology and showcase its effectiveness in managing complex software projects. Say goodbye to the traditional waterfall method and embrace a more flexible, adaptive process that is better suited for the ever-changing technology landscape. With the Agile process, you will learn how to tackle challenges through iterative cycles, constant testing and improvement, and effective communication with clients. Understand the four values of agility and adopt them to achieve better results in your projects. Mastering Team Dynamics In Chris Sims and Hilary Louise Johnson, the authors delve into the nuances of team dynamics. Drawing from real-life case studies and their own experience, they discuss the different stages of team development and highlight common mistakes teams make. The book emphasizes the importance of effective communication, trust, and accountability in building successful teams. Additionally, it offers practical tools and techniques for managing conflict, fostering innovation, and maximizing productivity. Overall, Chris Sims and Hilary Louise Johnson is a valuable resource for leaders and team members seeking to enhance their collaboration and achieve better outcomes. Rethinking the Waterfall Method the traditional waterfall method used for software development separates each step to make scheduling and planning easier for managers, but ultimately proves unreliable because software is too complex to be fully designed before production. Only 16% of projects using this method meet completion deadlines, while 31% are cancelled and 53% go over budget. The article suggests alternative methods of development to avoid these pitfalls. Agile development the key to flexibility. In a fast-paced technology market, agility is crucial. An agile development process enables teams to embrace change, work on a project a little at a time, and deliver pieces of a product to the client for feedback. This iterative cycle ensures that designers and coders think of their contributions as complementing one another and enables the client's requirements to be tweaked or changed throughout. Unlike the finish-to-start process used in a waterfall approach, Agile development treats each project as a complete unit. By choosing an Agile process, development teams can be flexible, adapt quickly, and ensure growth opportunities. The Four Values of Agility Agility is a priority-driven approach that values individuals and interactions over processes and tools, functional software over in-depth documentation, customer collaboration over contract negotiation, and responding to change over sticking to a plan. By adhering to these four values, Agile teams can set adaptive and efficient project priorities. While a plan can give you direction, staying flexible and open to change is key to success. Additionally, the people involved in a project should come first, followed by the product itself, and then any tools or processes needed to achieve success. Agile teams maintain open communication with clients and respond to their needs, which ensures that quality standards are met and all parties are satisfied with the outcome. By embracing agility, teams can navigate unforeseen obstacles and challenges to deliver successful projects in a constantly evolving environment. Introduction to Scrum Scrum is a software development process that implements the four values of agility, allowing teams to build new products through a series of sprints. Each sprint contains the full development process, from researching requirements to delivering the final product. Sprint planning meetings are split into two parts, determining the deliverables and figuring out how to achieve them. The product owner leads the first part by deciding what to build based on the client's wishes while presenting an ideal user experience, also known as a story. The team sets tasks during the second part, such as user interviews and testing, making sure that no task takes longer than half a day. User Stories, a key element in sprint planning. The use of user stories is a crucial part of every sprint planning meeting for delivering great user experience. A user story has three components, target user, user requirement, and the importance of the requirement. 
user stories keep the team's focus on the end customer rather than product owner, designer, or coder. Estimating the size of a user story is vital for successful sprint planning, and one way is to compare it with other stories using a relative size approach. The smallest story is used as a reference tool to identify big stories from smaller ones with a unique numbering system. Scrums, Sprint Reviews, and Retrospectives The Scrum method utilizes three types of meetings to avoid problems and ensure projects stay on track. A daily Scrum helps identify obstacles in real time, a Sprint Review allows clients to offer feedback, and a retrospective meeting allows teams to reflect on what they've learned and apply it to the next sprint. Are you tired of launching a project only to find roadblocks and misunderstandings pop up a few weeks into it? The Scrum method uses a combination of meetings to keep everyone on track and avoid mishaps. The daily Scrum is a short meeting held at the same time every day where team members share what they accomplished the previous day, what they plan to accomplish that day, and any roadblocks they're facing. This keeps everyone on the same page in real time. The sprint review is held at the end of each sprint and allows clients to offer feedback on the work done. This feedback helps the product owner adjust their to-do list, prioritizing tasks according to the client's needs. The retrospective meeting is held after the sprint review and is used to reflect on what was learned and apply it to future sprints. This meeting can identify areas that need improvement and help the team adapt to new developments in the project. By using these three meetings, the Scrum method ensures that your team stays on course and any obstacles are addressed quickly. It's an efficient way to manage project development and keep everyone informed and up to date. In conclusion, the Elements of Scrum provides valuable insights into adopting an agile approach to manage complex software development projects. By embracing agile and Scrum methodologies, you will experience increased flexibility, better customer collaboration, and improved outcomes. In contrast to the waterfall method, agile processes allow for constant adaptation and improvement during the development process, resulting in more successful projects. Don't let the complexity of software production impede your progress any longer. Grasp the key principles of Scrum and the four values of agility, and you're on your way to mastering project management for the ever-evolving realm of technology.